I'm gonna start today off by opening some mail just because I really love watching videos of people opening mail. I don't know why, I'm like a three-year-old endlessly fascinated by Kinder Egg opening videos. Some of this stuff is gonna be stuff that was sent to me. Some of this stuff is going to be stuff that uh, I ordered. This was sent to me by my friends at BBC America. I think this one was sitting in the mailbox for a while. Yeah, I was supposed to open this uh, when the finale aired. Um, sorry guys, but these are amazing. Huh? Where's my girl? There she is. There she is. I don't like Allison, I love Allison. I am genuinely very excited about this. It just, uh, it doesn't seem like it because I'm mortified by how long I left it in my mailbox. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, this is another uh, package from the BBC. So I'm gonna open this one just real quick. <gasps> oh. Dirk Gently was my favorite show of last year and season two is going on right now. Oh, they sent me a panic pee. I love it. Thank you so much. I'll try to open your mail in a more timely fashion, BBC America. I feel like a real jerk. You have a very fun name. Thank you for being a force for creative good. Oh, I don't know if that's true, but bless your heart. Saw this and had to send it your way. Take care, Sarah. Thank you, Sarah. Barrison Ford. This is too good. Oh, thank you. Uh, my buddy Bobby Miller is a brilliant filmmaker. His first feature last year with Johnny Galecki from The Big Bang Theory uh, and Angelica Houston and Oliver Platt. It was called The Master Cleanse. It, absolutely brilliant. This is, I think, his new short film. <laughs> His new film is called End Times. Uh, you should go check it out. He is a brilliant dude. Okay, this. You may be aware that I like the television series, The Flash, uh, particularly if you follow my instant gram. And if you watch The Flash, you know that everyone is always walking around in a Star Labs sweatshirt. Uh, and I wanted one of my own. You can find Star Lab sweatshirts uh, on Amazon and at a Hot Topic and convention. Here's the problem. Uh, they are wrong. They are bad and wrong. They're kind of cheaply made and you can tell they're not the exact same sweatshirt that the characters are wearing on the show and that really bugs me. I was like, this is driving me nuts. Can I truly be the only person bothered by this? And the answer is no. As per usual, Reddit was also bothered by this. And I found a thread that was instructions for creating a screen accurate Star Labs sweatshirt. I will link it down below. This is perfect. The stitching of this triangle the one that you buy in the store doesn't have this. The ones you buy in the store also don't have the shoulder stitching here, nor do they have the correct cuffs or bottoms. This is the exact sweatshirt they wear on The Flash. I have two modes. I either care far, far, far too much about something and need it to be absolutely perfect, or I just do not give a fuck and it can be whatever. Zero to 60, baby. I got so excited about one sweatshirt that I ripped the other sweatshirt off and um, I, lost, I lost the mic clip. This Bowser Wedding Amiibo is the most important Amiibo for Super Mario Odyssey. Lizard Daddy here tells you where all the good purple coins are. And I'm late game right now, and I'm at the point where every kingdom has like five or six purple coins I haven't found, and I am going insane. Help me, Lizard Daddy. Help me. All of this, all of this 
was just a preamble. This is no longer in its shipping box. This has been sitting in my house for weeks, unopened. This is the Lou 3.0 electric skateboard. And the reason it has been sitting unopened is because my wife, bless her heart, the love of my life, light of my soul, is terrified of me getting on an electric skateboard. But my wife is not here this weekend. And so it is time to open up the Lou. Open up the Lou sounds like something that would mean something dirty in Australia. Oh, they get right into it. Not much there to unbox. It's the skateboard. Okay. Wow. I somehow already turned this thing on. This is the board. This goes over the top. Power adapter, cable. And here's my remote. Okay, I'm gonna let my new Lou board charge overnight here, and then tomorrow morning I'm gonna take it on its inaugural ride. I am very excited. Be sure to subscribe if you wanna see that, and I will see you again soon.